Volcano Today Campi Flegre Volcano in Italy was hit by 150 earthquakes in just five hours. Europe's resurgent Campi Flegre volcano experienced its largest seismic wave in 40 years, with 150 earthquakes shaking the region in southern Italy on the night of May 20. A wave of 150 earthquakes rocked the Campi Flegre volcano near Naples last week, the largest earthquake in four decades. The seismic swarm began on May 20 just before 8 p.m. local time, 2 p.m. Eastern time including a magnitude 4.4 earthquake recorded at a depth of 1.6 miles 2.5 kilometers below the surface experts wrote in a statement the swarm lasted almost five hours triggering panic among residents in nearby towns but there were no reports of injuries 39 families were temporarily evacuated from their homes, and minor tremors were still felt around lunchtime on the 21st of May. This is the most powerful seismic swarm in the last 40 years, Mauro Antonio Di Vito, volcanologist and director of the Vesuvius Observatory of Italy's National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology INGV, told the news channel. Campi Flegre is Europe's largest active caldera, and the volcano is showing signs of possibly erupting. A caldera is a type of crater that forms when the roof of a volcano collapses into the magma chamber when the crater empties during an eruption. Campi Flegre last erupted in 1538. In the months before the explosion, the ground surface swelled and rose as high as 66 feet 20 meters then fell again as the volcano released its stored magma. The land beneath Pozzuoli, a town located near the center of the caldera, has risen over the past 20 years. Christopher Kilburn, a professor of volcanology and geophysical hazards at University College London in England, told Live Science in an interview in December 2023. The irregular seismicity pattern began occurring about 10 years ago and has continued to increase since then, Kilburn said. A similar pattern of swelling and seismic activity, known as a Brady seismic crisis, occurred in the 1970s and 1980s. Between 1982 and 1984, the ground surface in the Campi Flegre area rose at a rate of 3.5 inches 9 centimeters, per month, triggering more than 1,300 earthquakes per month according to the INGV statement. Most of the impact is too small to be felt, but the impact is starting to get bigger, so people can feel it and increase awareness," said Kilburn. And then everything stopped. The Earth's surface did not return to pre-crisis levels in the 1970s and 1980s, meaning any uplift would expand the Earth's crust. Every crisis begins where the previous crisis ended, Kilburn said. The ground is currently uplifting at a rate of 0.8 inches 2 centimeters, per month, according to the statement, and there has been no change in this rate since the seismic waves occurred last week. About 450 earthquakes have been recorded in the past month, compared with 1,252 in April 2024 most of which were magnitudes less than 1, according to CNN. Temperatures and carbon dioxide flows measured on the surface of Campi Flegre also showed no significant changes compared to recent months. The cause of the swelling is still unclear. There's some debate as to whether it's actually gas accumulation, magma accumulation, or a hydrothermal system being disrupted, Kilburn said. Whatever the exact cause, if you stretch something long enough, it will break somewhere. Following last week's seismic waves, Gaetano Manfredi, the mayor of Naples, said the situation was under control, and there was no risk of an eruption.